first day of the new year brought a variety of practically everything when it comes to wintry showers. We saw snow, sleet, freezing rain, and rain at different times today. It gets a little simpler moving forward, though, uh, as we look at the uh, advisories that we still have out. Winter weather advisories in effect until midnight. Uh, that's for mainly snow showers. As you can see, that covers all of the state lines. Basically, the spots highlighted here are where we may see some slushy roads going throughout the evening. Turning to radar, you can see that we have mostly snow popping up, at least indicated on radar. Of course, we've seen this throughout the day. There may still be a little rain or sleet or freezing rain trying to mix in here, but for the most part, we're transitioning over to snow showers, and we should stay just as snow throughout the rest of the night. Now, it could fall just heavily enough to cause some slushy accumulations. So something to watch out for over the course of the evening. You can see temperatures falling off. Uh, we're down to freezing now in Rockford. Got into the middle 30s earlier today, enough to kind of melt some of what was falling out of the sky, but back to that freeze point, and as you can see, that'll spread across the remainder of the state line. So once we get below freezing, it'll be all snow from here on out. So here is future track. We continue to see those light snow showers uh, through about 8.30, 9 o'clock, and then after that, we dry on out. So not seeing snow for too long this evening, but it does fall just long enough and just heavy enough to cause an additional couple inches of accumulation, picking up at least another Another inch to possibly two inches of snowfall through this evening and again it's falling just heavily enough to cause some slushy roads so don't get caught off guard if you have to go out tonight we are again looking at some slick spots here and there around the state line especially as things fall below freezing that could freeze any kind of melting snow or ice uh, or turn it into ice I should say uh, so be uh, definitely aware of that throughout the night and we will have you covered through the night as well check out our Facebook page at 8 o'clock I'll track the end of the showers how much snow is accumulating and then looking at a long-term outlook of how the rest of January is going to start on out. Some interesting trends there, so plenty to track again on our Facebook page at 8 o'clock. Uh, look for uh, you know, uh, the Facebook post about this. You can comment on there uh, to let us know if you have any questions. So for tonight, down to 21 for the overnight low under a mainly cloudy sky. Once that snow leaves after 10, we should be pretty quiet throughout the rest of the night. And we've got a fairly quiet weekend around the corner. Saturday's mainly cloudy and near freezing during the day. May have a few overnight flurries, but no accumulation expected out of that. And then Sunday provides a little more sunshine with temperatures slightly warmer and into the middle 30s. Looking beyond that, next week continues that warming trend. We're up into the upper 30s under partly cloudy to mostly cloudy conditions. Just a slight chance for rain on Wednesday. Otherwise, a long stretch of quiet weather is just around the corner. And in your most accurate 10-day forecast, conditions remain somewhat mild through next weekend with very low chances for rain and snow. So we've got a long, dry stretch upcoming, Mary. All right, Alex. Thank you.